Hey Wardy, I saw this in the critique section on the Psycho Forum, so I thought I'd take a whack at it. So, we go ahead and zoom in. Uh, when I first saw this, I thought it's it seemed like everything was kind of the same value at first to me, but actually whenever I put it in black and white, you actually have a really good... Uh, value structure going on here so like even from far away it reads okay uh, some of this stuff in the armor could be brought up to the same level so the silhouette comes out but I think the problem with it then is that all of your uh, colors are too similar like you have this uh, warm light source and then you have another warm secondary light source and then your ground is warm and yeah everything's just warm uh, and it's some of the ways you did these things because of that uh, I'm having a hard time reading the local value of things like she her skin's pretty red and I'm sure <laughs> I'm sure you didn't mean to make her red skinned but I th I'm guessing it's because of the fire you wanted that warmth there, but because we already have all of this other warmth, it's throwing me off. And I had the same problem with the the armor. I wasn't sure if it's meant to be gold or if it just looks gold. Because if you look right here, um, this kind of tells me that you meant it to be silver, but um, I'm not. Sh I mean, I'm assuming that because it's cold, but you're your skylight is warm so I think it's meant to be silver but even if it's not I think you should do that anyways because uh, like I said there you don't have any points of contrast um, so let's go ahead and select her out real quick and try to get her to read better uh, how about Just gonna paint with black on the color layer, and of course this. I'm not gonna keep it like this. We need color in there, obviously, but this is gonna help me get it to show up against all that warmth. And I want to do this with her skin too, since she's a Caucasian, I want to make her a little bit more pale. So it shows up well against all that warmth. I'm guessing she's supposed to be blonde, so I'm going to leave that as it is. Should be good. face to be paler though. Sorry if I get quiet, it's hard to talk and think at the same time. already that's showing up better in my opinion <laughs> I guess that was supposed to be smoke or something but but I think it's distracting 
And then this can go a little bit more saturated. This ground should be a different color uh, because it's matching the shadow color on the on the building, it shouldn't. So let's make this. Let's knock back some of that. And since this is the shadow side, let's make that more saturated. Something I noticed here, you were asking about the pose. And it's not bad. There are a few things I would change though, like this leg. Uh, sorry, I don't know why it's doing that. From the top, it looks like it would be something like so here, arm here, knee there, and it looks like you're doing this with the other leg. I don't know where that other arm is going, which is a problem. Um, so this part looks broken, like. I need to see this as an underplane and this as another plane if this is what it's doing. So let's fix that. Uh, this is actually away from the light, so it's fine. We should. I mean, it's fine to change. It needs to change, anyways. This foot is touching this foot, and it shouldn't. Let's fix that real quick.
Oh, uh, so something I noticed right away is the arm is too short. Um, go joint there, joint there. Like this matches, but uh, if she were to stand up, I feel like this would be really tiny. Like if I swing this around. It doesn't feel right to me. I could be wrong, I guess her crotch is here, huh? Let me lengthen it a little bit and see if that helps. Something feels wrong about it. I'm already looking at more. So now we're gonna have to move this to Feeling a bit more natural. You're saying 
something about not knowing how to uh, detail the face, I think. Let's see. Uh, a lot of trouble with the lighting. A lot of trouble lighting the face and detailing it further. Okay. So let's light the face. Uh, actually, what I want to do is, so I can get more detail. And light the hair with it. Copy that, make a new layer. Double it up. Uh, it's triple. Zoom out on this for reference. Okay. Let's check proportions. Looks right, but I want to make sure. It's actually kind of surprising that you're... Well, I guess you're talking about lighting, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, surprising that you're having trouble with faces because I've seen you do good faces before. You said lighting faces, so... needs to be moved up. Okay. Now. Uh, I don't know if you know this proportion, but um, usually halfway between the bottom of the nose and the bottom of the chin is where the bottom lip would be and now that I look at that <laughs> this is tilted the wrong way
even though I I made the skin colder um it's still in it's still in the warms like if I were to color pick here you see it's still a warm color uh, so because you're putting a warm light on a warm local color it'll actually get do the opposite of what light normally does where it gets more and more desaturated and it's actually going to saturate so I think of it like a like a red light on a red ball but right now the this is blending in too much but right right now it's because uh, the values are wrong so we'll fix that as we go if you wanted her to be wearing makeup or not um, she's wearing armor so I'm assuming she's a warrior so she probably doesn't need makeup so I'm going to remove it can always add that back pretty easily if you want it can however have bags under her eyes off here. This is the wrong angle. So is this.
and it looks like she has a fat eye right now, so we need to fix that. Fat eye is in... she got punched in the eye. I want to redraw these eyes actually. Kind of bugged me. And he made a cold sky here in a second. <laughs> because then I'll have to do warm light, warm shadow. Let's take this.
Asian. <laughs> We're so fabulous. Like that. Although you had the eyelids, so I'm gonna put that back in. I'm tired. Tired.
getting there. This is definitely off. Because if you have a part over here, then why is it coming up over here too? <laughs> so that needs to be changed. Oh, it's not tied. So there just doesn't need to be a bump then. Okay, okay. At least I don't think it's tied. Maybe you meant to. I'm gonna go with whatever's easier. <laughs> and not make it tight. I think I'm getting too warm. Me too. Make it like warmer.
Let's get a little subsurface scattering in here. Too much, I think. Something about this nose doesn't feel right. coming from the bottom. So means the top plane can't be lit. Set off both of them.
looks way better. <laughs> Sorry about the detour. This is helping something. <laughs> Skip around at least. Skip through the video, I mean, not literally skip around. Ah, this. I feel like I made the skin too red. It's 
more realistic right now, but still. It was times three hundred, so twenty five percent. That's correct. Nope. really stupid right now because I don't know the map. Uh, hold on.
This is blood, so it shouldn't be this bright. Except where the light's going through it. This guy's not that cold, but it's for the sake of variety. Cheated a bit there. And this hand is in shadow. So. Surface carry. This stuff on the inside it actually doesn't make any sense if there's not a light in there. So uh, either you're telling me that the sun's still up and it's over here, or it can't be that bright. Even if it was white, it would be more like you have here, but it's not white. So. At least I don't think it's white. If it's meant to be white, it can't be that color. <laughs> I know white is reflective, but it would be lighter. Like, uh, well, more desaturated, I should say.
fingers and that's the underside. Can give it a little bit of reflected light then. Just to differentiate it from the pillars. Actually, all in shadow should only be getting hit by our secondary light source. This can be pretty darn saturated. Because the light's going to be shining through it. Some parts darker just to suggest the folds.
darken the side just to help differentiate between the side plane and the top and front. That'll do it. Uh, let me just add a vignette to help push you to the center, but also just because it looks cool. crazy long video was helpful uh, let me know see you later